holding the transducer in a horizontal position, localize the bicipital groove on an axial plane. Then slide caudally to evaluate the vertical part of the long head of biceps tendon up to the myotendinous junction. At this level the humeral insertion of the pectoralis major tendon can be seen, as best demonstrated with dynamic evaluation. Always remember that to avoid any anisotropy artifacts, the transducer must be kept as perpendicular as possible to tendon surface. Then rotate the probe 90 degree clockwise to evaluate the tendon along its long axis. For its oblique course, optimal visualization of the tendon can be obtained by slightly pressing the distal edge of the probe on the skin. Further information about the tendon stability should be obtained making the patient abduct the flexed arm and, at the same time, holding the probe on the bicipital groove with an axial scan. In normal condition the tendon should be seen within the groove during the entire maneuver.